Hello, in this video I will show you how to format numbers with the string method and built-in numeric formatting. So let's jump into that. You have probably used the string method to convert some non-string value to string so you can put it in the, your text field. But the string function is very powerful so let's see what can we do with that function. Before we start, all important links with additional information will be in the description of this video. In Unity we use numbers a lot for time, score, money or whatever. In most cases we need to format them somehow. The string function has three additional implementations. And to format numbers we need to know how string format works. String format takes form where the first part is format specifier and second part is precision specifier. Format specifier is a single alphabetic character that specifies the type of a number format. Precision specifier is an optional integer that affects the number of digits in the resulting string. The precision specifier controls the number of digits in the string representation of a number. It does not round the number itself. The string method round numbers using midpoint rounding away from zero, that means that it always rounds to a bigger number. So we have few standard format specifiers already implemented, so let's go through them. First is C for currency. If you use this format specifier value will represented in currency format, you also need to use culture info which is I format provider. For culture info you have a link in the description in which you can see culture info codes for all world cultures. But in this example I will use few. First one is C1 format which means it will use a dollar currency and one decimal place. Second one is C3 and use FR-FR culture which represents France, so currency will be Euro and it has different formats from the American one. Third one is Japanese and it has five decimal places, even if the number doesn't have that amount of decimal places it adds zero to fill up and format is what is used in Japan. Last one is like the first one but if you leave the precision specifier it uses by default. D for decimal, where precision specifier specifies minimum number of digits. This is useful for score or some displays with specific amount of digits. In my example, if specifier is less than the amount of numbers, numbers will be shown normally, but if the specifier is bigger like last example 6, then it fills empty spaces with zeros. E exponential, I haven't used this one but probably if you have big numbers and you can represent them like this. There are few examples what you can do with this format, you can also use culture info for formatting. F stands for fixed point, this is useful because with precision specifier you can specify how many decimal digits you want to be shown. It also supports all numeric types, with this you can also use culture info. And the last one is P for percentage. The result is a number multiplied by 100 and displayed with percent symbol. Where precision specifier is a number of decimal places, this also use culture info. It also supports all numeric types. There are also formats number, general, round trip and hexadecimal, but you can read more on them in links below. So that's it for this video. In this video I show you how to format numbers using built-in formatting options using to string function. With this you can skip some steps that you will do manually. For example rounding and then calling to string method with this, it's done automatically. This topic is huge and C Sharp has so much to offer, so I will provide you links for more information about this topic. Thank you guys for watching, I hope you like this video, if you like it please leave a like and subscribe and if you want to support me more you can do that by supporting me on Patreon or buy one of my assets at Unity Asset Store. Discord channel was launched few days ago so come and join, also follow me on socials. All links are in the description. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one, bye bye.